What's up traders, Richard here with Lionheart Elite Wave Analysis giving you another quick dose of uh, wave surfing. So let's just get started here now. Uh, what I wanted to do today is update you guys all on uh, um, on this bullish view that I had right with this uh, dollar hawk and what a ride it was. Yeah, the dollar ND, the, the dollar index actually performed very nicely here. Now I have to be honest with you, I was expecting it to actually stop about there on descending diagonal however you know uh, it did go down and then on this ending diagonal inverted right here on this support we were actually present in the green room so uh, we noticed that it might it might basically go up once more right so that's exactly what happened so now how this how this thing is actually unfolding uh, but before I do that I'm gonna let you guys know that I updated the wave count. I'm no longer counting it in a, a minor or intermediate scale. With four, I actually switched to wave A. Uh, most of you guys who are following me know exactly why, because it moved past the fibs, the Fibonacci levels. Yeah, I moved past these fibs, this fibs. So, uh, in other words, uh, it doesn't mean that it's bullish. It means that the structure is uh, different right and the way i'm seeing this uh, structure is being a um, intermediate scale abc for uh, later to come um, basically let's say outcome right so let's see what we have here in uh, in current times now the way i'm labeling this is as a one two three four complex structure right here with ending diagonal in the five then four um, minute green and an ending diagonal expanding ending diagonal very rare though yeah but what's actually curious is that it's performing in the last fifth wave this minuet black five it's actually doing an ending diagonal a contracting ending diagonal yeah a rising wedge uh, with a bearish divergence right here with a pinch of uh, of a bearish divergence right there yeah so what uh, what I'm actually seeing right here is a very very possible, in my personal opinion, reversal on the dollar index. So, in other words, um, multiple assets uh, such as gold, uh, silver, euro USD, pound, uh, pound dollar. Uh, also, let's say for instance, USD Swiss, USD Yen. They're they're basically showing reversal patterns, right? So something's gonna go down. Um, and I'm expecting dollar index to actually um, start a bearish run. Now I'm not sure how this structure would perform if it's going to be an impulse or an impulse of a corrective piece. That's left to be seen. Yeah, that's um, basically what I'm trying to say is that regardless of how the structure performs, um, a reversal would be expected here. But according to how the structure would look. That will give me more details about basically how um, how it will perform if it's gonna create a new low or if it's a B wave indeed, right? So we'll basically see now. For instance, the the mo most can go because I'm expecting this to bounce around in this ending diagonal and make an overview before the fall. Yeah. So the most it can go would be this level which is 94.90 close to 90 95 right there at this fibs basically from 3 to 4 61.8 right there and of course from this from this things so 1 2 and then abc in 3 with an ending diagonal in the c 4 and then abc you can actually see how the fibs are lining up right there just waiting for the hammer for this ending uh, for, for sorry for for this um, bearish divergence right so in other words multiple signs uh, multiple technical signs are pointing towards a uh, bearish possible outcome for the dollar and it seems that the bulls are kind of running out of steam i would say uh, so which means that the bears could take over and gain control this is basically the effect of the divergence. So we've noticed, uh, let's say today, even in the green room, um, don't worry, in the, in the green room, basically that's the trading room, obviously, um, 
we've been tracking this rise corrections rise 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 rise. we, we were very 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 busy there but the point is that um, I've been tracking this reversal for quite some time yeah and I really think that uh, this is it now how it will unfold that's basically that, that's left to be seen so that's that's basically what I wanted to, to, to share with you all today I know I'm in a hurry because I only have like five minutes left yeah but the point is um, that uh, let's say for instance even this this post right here I mean this uh, DXI Matador taking the USD bull down yeah, yeah, yeah. this is approaching some uh, some levels which are this ones right here okay and not only that but the posts uh, that I've done on the site uh, basically for let's say for instance a, a bullish run for uh, the euro USD a bullish run for pound dollar a bearish run for USD yen and USD Swiss uh, bullish run for silver uh, and also let's say for instance for DAX that one is already uh, you know topped out and in, in, in the green but the point is that um, this this setup looks very very promising yeah now I will take the time because I, I have a few few minutes left. I'm gonna answer some questions that you guys um, you know address. For instance, do you have a trading room? Yes, it's the green room. You can see you can actually access it on the site. It's for members only though. Um, do you have a? I mean, do you recommend a broker? Yes, we do recommend a broker. It's on the website. That's for sure. And you can actually get a free membership just by trading with that broker. Uh, now another one. How does the website work? Well, it's very simple. The website works with memberships, and the website would recognize you uh, immediately if you do have a membership, which you can basically get it from the shop. Uh, do you get a? F I mean, do, do you offer a free trial? Yes, we do. I do offer a free trial. It's a two weeks limited free trial. You can test it out. If you don't like it, it's okay, right? But I'm sure you will. Um, yeah, that's that's pretty much it. But, but the idea of this video is to um, is to say that there's a bearish divergence present on the dollar, so it could run out of steam. The bears could take over, and I I think it's going down. Yeah, so it's I mean I'm all I'm all dollar uh, bearish right now. So we'll basically see what happens. I'm gonna update you guys. Um, <clears throat> as it unfolded i know you might think that it's been a long time since since the last uh, you know since the last dose last video but i've been busy i've been really really busy um not not with other stuff but i've been busy in the green room i've been busy with the site with um, ideas setups uh, you know high probability trades and all that levels etc so uh, I wasn't lazy. I was actually present. Just that I didn't post some free stuff. Now, this thing is indeed free, so um, I'm just trying to help you guys out here to maybe, um, maybe help you to make some profits. Yeah, that's the whole point of it. So, yeah, that's about it for now. As I like to say to all my traders, until next time, stay in the green and many pips ahead.